Hello folks, this is Mad Dog, and this is the Dude Moto Vlogs that you're watching. And we're in uh, Kalkaska, Michigan here, at the trailhead here off of 72. Alright, looks like we're where the P is for parking. I guess we'll be going up this way towards what sunset trail I think that's what it says yeah looks like that get the bike warmed up here I have never been out here. I've never gone riding out here in Kalkaska. Out here along 72, I mean. I've ridden in Kalkaska just now. There's one of those famous Northern Michigan black squirrels. We'll take it easy here for a minute and let the bike warm up a little bit. Then we'll get into running the bike a little harder. I think we might have a little bit too much air in the tires for, these, for this much sand. And it's really dry, so it's pretty loose. I can tell the bike isn't warmed up, doesn't want to take the throttle very good. My shield's already steamed up, so I guess I'll just leave my shield open. I guess we'll try that instead. There's a hair already on my nose. That is my... Oh, that's my uh, fuzzy thing for my microphone. Alright, we'll try this again. I'm going to drive with my shield open and try that. Whenever you're trail riding like this, especially when you're in an area you've never been, been riding before, it's always good to take a little slow the first time. Well, and keep your, keep your head up and don't look right in front of your bike, look farther out. So if there is an obstacle in front of you, you see it before you get to it so you have time to stop or go around it or, you know, or if there's someone else coming towards you, you see them. cobwebs in here. I can feel them hitting my face because I have my shield open. I'd rather have my shield shut, but it keeps this uh, shield always steams up.
Oh, we got a hill back in here. Looks like this could be interesting. Oh, yeah, it's a pretty good sized hill. Oh, that was picker bushes. I dragged all up my arm. <laughs> I guess I could turn around and see if we can climb that sand hill in there. Looks like it could be fun. Pretty good little hill in here. Pretty fun. Hey, I guess we'll just turn around. I just wanted to climb that hill. First time being out in a little while, so get a little practice climbing these hills. Because I'm from right now I live in Tennessee, but I'm here in northern Michigan. I mean I grew up here, but I haven't really been riding a lot out here so it's been probably a month or so since I've been riding so I figured get a little practice in climbing one of these sand hills here before we get to bigger hills it seemed like I had no trouble climbing it I think I could let some air out of my tires I have I have about 20 pounds of air in the tires. The last time I rode this bike, I was riding it on the, because it has a license plate, I was riding it on the asphalt, so I, I aired up the tires to 20 pounds, so it's not so squirrely. But then, I think I forgot to air them down now that we're in the sand here. And they're universal tires, so they don't grip very good to begin with. Get a little bit of air there. Oh, that was a stump. I almost hit my peg on that. People always ask me in the comment section what kind of bike this is. And this is a Honda CRF 230L, which is street legal. So it's not really the best bike to be doing uh, narrow trails on because it's kind of heavy, but at least it's low to the ground so you can put your feet down. But I think after this, I'll probably be getting like a, I don't know, maybe like a KTM or a Husqvarna or something. Like a 300 or 310 Husqvarna, something like that. Or, I've seen a couple of those uh, KLX, KLX 250, like the water pumper version. I kind of like those, and I, I had one of those back in 2009. I had one. I liked it. You know, it's a pretty good bike. But I sold it when I moved. But now I sort of wish I would have just kept it. Oh, there's another hill in here. <laughs> Looks like someone had trouble climbing it. See all the big ruts there where they got stuck. All these things hanging over the trail, every one of those is pickers. I guess I'm all right. That picker bush there hit me right in the face, but I guess I'll put my shield down. All right, here we go again. <laughs> 